guys welcome back to my channel so for today's video i'm going to show you how i roofed this house which will also be helpful if you're just learning how to roof houses in general um i picked my hardest roof build so far to show you and it didn't go quite as planned because obviously i'd already done this build so i deleted all the roofs off the top and then tried to put them all back and i couldn't remember what i'd done so i had to actually stop and redo it all over again so here I'm just kind of deleting the roofs that I had. So as you can see, there's only two kind of separate um, pieces for the upstairs, which I have not used to make rooms. So if you download the shell of this build, you could put a little room up there if you wanted to, or you could even extend it along. So here I put the smaller roof piece along the top. It was the, um, the first one in, um, and then I made a second one and that go goes with the outside there. Then I made a second roof piece which covered the other main part of the build, which you'll see me dragging across here, which goes along the length. Now I realised towards the end this roof piece actually needs to come out one square more, um, which you will see um, in a little bit. Um, I've got this on normal speed as well so you can see exactly what I did. I had to extend that over one more because I missed the square and I do make the roof a little higher in a bit too. And as you can see from this angle the back piece that's sticking out with the wall it's not the same length so that's when I realised I had to extend it over but I do that in a little bit. And I put these roof pieces on. This one I turned for this angle um, as I was going off obviously the Pinterest video and I usually I would roof before doing anything else with the shell so it's usually easier to figure that out then but at this point I hadn't. So I had that piece there and eventually the bigger roof piece will go in one more and then out one more which you'll see me doing a bit anyway. This was me just trying to figure out the length of the roof pieces why it wasn't matching up and again going back and re-roofing something the same as you've already roofed it is very confusing. <laughs> um, I will do a few more um, how to's on roof buildings and I'll do them first at the start before making it at the beginning. Now these pieces here I struggled trying to remember how I did it because it wasn't looking so much like this second roof piece this little small one was supposed to be to the side of that and the two windows it just didn't look right as you can see here I do figure it out in a few moments that it was supposed to go to the left one and I think I realized that once I do the bigger piece of the roof when I was like, ah, okay, this is why. So I mess around with that little piece first. And also, if you want to change the, as you know, I'll tell you that in a moment because I do that in a minute. Um, but you'll see, you know, I'm going to leave that. I'm going to tell you that once we get to it because I'll just confuse you even more. So I was just, again, fiddling around with this piece. I just couldn't quite figure out why it wasn't looking right. I knew how it was supposed to be. I just couldn't figure out why it was like that, which is why I'm messing around with this so much, because the windows were supposed to be, like, central, and I knew they were already in the right place. Again, do the roof first and everything else last. So where are we here? See, so yeah, this is where I had made the walls, uh, the roof on this one slanted slightly. And then did I do it on this one yet? No, so I put this piece in here first. Sometimes you have to put the roof piece in a bit more, drag it to the size you want it and then adjust it because when you put it on, when there's not a wall already there or a tile's already there underneath, it'll go to the ground below, which obviously you don't want to do. So I made this the length I wanted it and I remembered I had two pieces in this section. I just couldn't quite remember why. So see how I had to place it there drag it along at the front and then make it shorter again from that side and then bring it in one here my tree is in the way but you can see that arrow and then here for that little side corner if you hold the shift when you get the shift button that little corner triangle you can just make the one side shorter instead of both and then i did the same for this roof piece which is why i did two separate pieces and then i just had to try and figure out what length that needed to be so I raised it up a little bit more, I believe, to match the other one, because I was trying to, again, make it the exact same as how I'd had it, which just wasn't working. I just could not remember how I did it. Um, and then, again, the uh, control, the shift button, making it smaller again. And then I went to this root piece, and I did this one sideways and did it one long across. So you'll see me do that now. I realised I'd made the roof too big on this corner, 
and then you'll see obviously those that window there doesn't match up and I realized I need to bring it out one more on that corner too so it's just checking it out you'll see me realize that in a moment because I'm like it does not match why does that roof not match and again you just make sure everything's attached to each other so I came back around to the front realized that roof needed to be higher and then to the middle did I do this yet yeah. there that's the big piece as you can see I got very confused with what I was doing but it's starting to come together now so then it was make that one tile smaller and then I'm sure I made that roof piece higher up I'm supposed to maybe I didn't okay that roof piece is higher you'll see at the start of the video that roof piece was a lot higher I just forgot so yeah that uh, larger roof piece was supposed to be a bit higher but it's fine you get the idea guys and I will try and do more roofing videos just one that's better than this one because the voiceover on this one wasn't great because again I was so confused with going like obviously deleting the roofs and going back it just wasn't going to how I'd done it the first time which was annoying um, and again just these little roof pieces here I've done this before in a little how to but I just because I already like I'm showing you this build itself I'm doing that now so it's just getting the right length holding the shift button and bringing that corner piece in um, and then putting the other one up there it just wasn't fitting on the right size so as you can see you couldn't see it so I undid it and made it slightly bigger or let me move it more forward yeah, I moved it more forward and then I extended it along made it shorter at the other side and there we have it a nice little roof piece just gonna change the colors on it um, but yeah I thought this went quite well like I really do love the style of this build is um, again it was off Pinterest which I use um, in, if you want to see the full speed build of this house it's literally the video before this one um, I think I named it Pinterest shell build maybe Pinterest base game build something like that it's in my base, screen, base game um, playlist and it's in my house well this one itself is in my how to playlist but the speed build of this whole house is in my how to not my how to my base game base game and Pinterest or oh, no base game and real to sims playlist is the speed build of this house this one itself is just going to be in the how to's so that is it so i'm just kind of showing you the roof again around so uh, if you did enjoy this video thank you so much for watching and if you want to know how to do anything else just let me know